Welcome back to another quick guide today I'll teach you how to set Sedge notification sounds on iPhone. Setting Sedge notification sounds on an iPhone is a bit more complex than on Android as the iPhone doesn't allow direct access to third party apps like Sedge. For setting notification tones, however, you can still use Sedge to get custom notification sounds with the help of GarageBand and your iPhone settings. Here's how to do it. First, open the Sedge app. Now go to Discover, Word Search icon. Go to Sounds, tap on it. Browse and download the notification sound you want from Sedge. Remember, Sedge won't directly set the tone, so you'll need to follow the next steps. Tap on your chosen sound, then tap on download button. Then tap on set on device. Once you've downloaded the sound, tap on save to files. Tap on save in the top right. Then go to the files app. Go to the browse section. Then choose downloads. Then tap on the audio. Then tap on OK. Trim and edit the sound. Typically, notification sounds should be brief under 30 seconds. Now double tap on the ringtone, then tap on loop. Once you're done editing, tap the down arrow in the top left corner and choose my songs. Long press the project you just created. Tap share. Then choose ringtone. Tap on continue. Tap on export. After exporting, you'll be asked if you want to use sound as a ringtone. Now tap OK. If you prefer to use it for another notification type, just go to settings, sounds and haptics, and assign the sound to alerts like text tone. New mail, send mail, calendar alerts, reminder alerts, other app. For example, I'm going to tap on text, then scroll down and choose the ringtone. Now, you can enjoy using your custom Sedge notification sound for various alerts on your iPhone. And that's all for now, folks. Thanks for watching.